All right, y'all, so here's the first down. Just my middle part. With how I usually wear my locks is just the middle part. First one. All right, now second one. It's basically the same thing, but I'm putting the part to the side. This is more classy, okay? This makes it look more classy, like you're trying to put something together. And you can't slick down your edges. Me, I don't, unless I'm really trying to, you know, fix my locks up and sometimes I also put it behind my ear that's a style just little things that you can do with your locks so really make them pop and color them you want to know how to color your hair make sure you check out my video on me revealing my color how I bleached and did this all right so my third style is my basically half up half down but it's like front and back instead of like half up half down half front half back girl i don't know hell i'm putting a little ponytail in the back and leaving like half the front of my hair out and it's just real cute and chic like look y'all real cute you can leave out however many you would like put up however many you would like but this is how i usually do my i don't really count them i just grab a handful of hair in the back and put it up my what are we on for fourth style is basically my two buns in the front so i put one on the left boom and with locks i like how they just stick up and just they stick all over the place like i just think that just makes the style like it's very natural <laughs> Don't mind me, y'all. It's raining. I'm tired today. So I'm going to put my little second bun in. And I'm going to leave the back out. And boom. And I think this is just like mad cute. That's my little... Now this is a half up, half down, but with two buns. So yeah. Can wear that on a daily basis this fifth style is basically my barrel twist that i do in the front now you can do your whole hair with barrels but i'm trying to show you like quick easy hairstyles you can do in probably less than three minutes like if you're just trying to get your hair out your face or if you just want it to look a little cute like put a little style to it these are styles that you can do in less than three minutes so I just put a barrel twist right down the middle, not all the way down, but halfway back at the front of my head. Also, if y'all want to see how I do my two barrel twists on the sides, two going straight back, I'll gladly show you all that. But here, if you know how to do a barrel twist, you know it's the twist. Then from there, you're putting the locks on top of each other. You want a detailed video, y'all let me know. But that's all I'm doing, just barrel twisting it as far as back as I want it. Then I'm either going to secure it with either a rubber band or some bobby pins. And as y'all see, I'm using red rubber bands. It's a black one here, but red rubber bands, so you can't really notice. Like, I don't know why, I just don't like, like, black rubber bands on colored hair. I don't know, but I have red ones, y'all. So I'm using red if you're like, why we can't see her rubber bands in her hair? Like, because it's basically the same color as my hair. So here's this style, my little barrel twist with the rest down. When I first started my locks, I wore this a lot. Once I learned how to barrel twist, this is what I was wearing, y'all. So where we at? Six. 
Now, the sixth one is mad cute. Okay. This is for this is for my ladies right here. This is the two ponytails. And I'm not talking buns. Like, the two ponies that's like just... Y'all, I think the crinkle look just makes it even cuter. Like, and if... Y'all probably wondering, like, how I got the crinkles or whatever, the little curls in my hair. I two-stranded my twist when I retwisted my hair. And I left it in for, what, a week? And took it out, and this is what you get. So that's another style in the beginning, like, if you just want to wear your locks down, just crinkly, like, there you have it. So, y'all, this is the two ponies, the little two ponytails. And they're just so cute, and I think this color just really makes it even cuter. Y'all, so if I could keep this color forever, I mean, I can, but I get bored after a while. I think just because I've just had it only, what, a week now? Not even that long. I'm really starting to love it. Look at this. Y'all, my hair got mad long. This is super cute. <laughs> I wanted to leave this one in and just end it with this one. <laughs> but I think I have, what, one more left for y'all? Okay, Ashley, I get it. Here's the last one. This is what, seven? Yes, yeah, seven styles for y'all. Basically half up, half down with the two little locks in the front. That's mad cute. I do that a lot. This is probably this. This style and the uh, ponytail in the back with the hair out in the front is basically my little go-to. Because I try not to put too much stress on my locks. By putting them up in tight ponytails or tight twists and those types of things. So I try to do something that's real loose on my hair. So I don't need my locks thinning out, baby. Okay. Okay. And as you see, I took another rubber band to make the little bun. I'm going to fix that, y'all. It might look a little crazy right now, but I'm going to get it together. And as you can see, that's a red rubber band, so you can't really tell there's a rubber band on my head. I mean, you can, but it's not black and noticeable to just knock off the whole look. But here's a look, honey. Here's a look. This is cute. This red, y'all, definitely complements my com complexion. Look at me. Can't even say it. Yes, honey. <laughs> I knew I was going to feel myself. But that's basically all of them, y'all. That's my little seven go-to styles on my locks when I'm rushing. Three minutes or less. Every one. If you just started, it might take five minutes. But check it out. Ooh, check it out. And like I said, this is a look just to wear it out after you've two strand twisted if y'all want to see how i updated video on how i retwist my hair my two strand twist y'all let me know thank you all for watching i'll see y'all next time